I am perhaps most famous on TV for a giant fight I had with Bill O'Reilly about pot. I'm pro-legalization and he's not. By making you another want to perpetuate a socially acceptable. You That's want to perpetuate want. a system that is already not working. Is it working properly right now, Bill? And then in the past year or so, um, my personal life has become more public. Tragedy has hit the Fox News channel. Fox News contributor Mary Catherine Ham's husband, Jake Brewer. 34-year-old Jake Brewer, who worked in the White House. He was killed in a bicycle accident while doing something for others. We were together not because of our politics or because we thought this was a cute branding idea, but because we believed that people are more than their politics. And that's how you make a country where people can work together, is when you recognize that. I actually, one of the things I enjoy doing and one of the things that makes me feel better is telling his story and telling our story. And when something hits you over the head in life that makes no sense whatsoever, a 34-year-old promising, incredible, healthy dude just struck down in his prime uh, with a kid on the way, you want to make sense of it. So I stood up and talked about it, and I wrote about it, and I tried to make sense of something. I'm never going to make sense of what happened that one day, but I can make sense of our lives and our future and our daughters. Um, so that's what I've tried to do.